Indian researchers have just made a breakthrough that could change the future of solar energy. Imagine generating electricity using living algae. Yes, you heard that right. A team of scientists from Amrita Vishwa Vidyapidam University in Coimbatore, India has developed solar cells from living algae, a cutting edge technology that could one day provide a green, sustainable solution to our planet's energy needs. By using freshwater macroalgae, this biophotovoltaic device, though still in its early stages, holds massive potential to revolutionize the solar energy industry. The research team has been able to harvest energy from algae, a naturally occurring resource, and create a functioning solar cell. But that's not all. These algae-based cells manage to generate a photocurrent of 1.25 milliampere and a photovoltage of 0.5 voltage under UV light without the need for any external power. And if you think that's impressive, wait till you hear the full story behind this groundbreaking discovery, including its future potential in everyday low power devices. Stay tuned till the end to find out how this new technology could help solve some of the biggest challenges in renewable energy today. So how exactly did they do it? The team's innovation lies in their use of Pitophora, a freshwater filamentous macroalgae. This type of algae is commonly found either growing at the bottom of water bodies or forming dense mats on the surface. The algae was collected from a pond, carefully cleaned, and then crushed into tiny fragments. To create the solar cell, the researchers sandwiched this LJ biofilm between two special electrodes. The top electrode was a carbon-coated copper layer, while the bottom electrode was made of titanium oxide-coated fluorine-doped tin ID or FTO. The titanium oxide layer acted as an electron transport layer, allowing the electrons generated during the photosynthetic process to move efficiently, while the carbon served as the whole transport layer. The algae itself, still alive within the device, continued its natural photosynthesis, converting sunlight into chemical energy which was then transformed into electrical energy by the modified electrodes. This type of biophotovoltaic technology has never been seen before in such a practical device ready form, making it a real game changer for renewable energy. What's particularly exciting about this technology is its potential application in powering small, low energy devices, especially in the growing field of IoT. This research has published in the prestigious Journal of Science, Advanced Materials and Devices. The authors report that the algae-based solar cell generated a 0.35 volt open circuit voltage and a short circuit current of 10.19 microampere, even without exposure to sunlight. When the researchers tested the device under UV light with a wavelength of 365 nanometers, the results were even more astonishing. The cell exhibited a photocurrent of 1.25 milliampere and a photovoltage of 0.5 voltage, again, without any external bias or power being applied. This remarkable achievement was made with a device just one square centimeter in size. But the researchers didn't stop there. When they connected 10 of these devices in series under natural sunlight, they generated an impressive 5.53 volt with a light intensity of just 0.6 suns. This means the technology could one day be used to power small IoT devices that require minimal energy, like sensors or medical equipment, using only natural sunlight. This kind of biological photovoltaic system represents a radical departure from traditional silicon-based solar cells, which rely on expensive, energy-intensive and sometimes toxic materials. In contrast, the algae used in this biosolar cell are grown in water and are completely renewable. The materials for the electrodes, 
such as carbon and titanium oxide are also abundant and relatively cheap. The researchers believe that this technology could be an eco-friendly, low-cost alternative to conventional solar cells, especially for applications where small amounts of power are needed. Think about remote sensors, wearable electronics, or even small-scale energy harvesting for homes in off-grid areas. The possibilities are endless, and this technology could help us break away from our dependence on silicon-based systems that require high-tech infrastructure and resources. However, while this discovery is incredibly promising, the researchers acknowledge that there are still some significant challenges to overcome before LG-based solar cells can be scaled up for widespread use. One major issue is the low efficiency of the current devices. While they are able to generate electricity, the power output is far lower than that of traditional solar panels. This limitation is primarily due to the liquid reservoir that the LG need to survive. The presence of this liquid makes the device less efficient and complicates its scalability. The team has highlighted this as one of the key hurdles that need to be addressed in future iterations of the technology. They are optimistic though, stating that while the current LG-based solar cells may not yet compete with silicon technology in terms of power output, they represent a significant step towards a more sustainable and environmentally friendly approach to energy generation. To put things er in perspective, uh, perspective, this is not the first time researchers have looked at biological systems to generate electricity, but this development is unique in its use of living algae as a bioactive material within a functional solar cell. Just last month, a team of South Korean scientists experimented with green algae by combining it with carbon nanofibers to create a new type of cell. Meanwhile, earlier this year, a group from Spain's University of Cordoba identified a bacterial community that could work in tandem with microalgae to produce hydrogen through microbial metabolism, potentially leading to another form of green energy production. What makes the work of the Indian researchers truly groundbreaking is the use of freshwater algae, which is abundant, easily cultivable, and fully sustainable, making it a strong candidate for future renewable energy solutions. And now we can say that, while there's still work to be done to perfect and scale up this technology, the creation of algae-based solar cells by Indian researchers is a giant leap forward in the quest for sustainable energy solutions. Imagine a world where algae grown in ponds could be powering our homes, devices and cities. And now, do you think this new solar cell is good or not practical? If you found this exciting and want to stay updated on the latest in green technology, make sure to subscribe and turn on notifications because the future of solar energy is closer than we think. Thanks for watching. And we will be happy if you watch our videos about renewable energy. Have a nice day.